So here's how to make Reddit story videos with AI. We've all seen those Reddit story videos on YouTube that are getting thousands of views, if not hundreds of thousands or millions. So for this tutorial, we will be using NVIDIA AI. And as you can see, we're already here on the website. First, let's check out their pricing plans. And as you can see, they have free, plus, max, and generative. You can also check out their monthly and yearly pricings. So to start off with our Reddit story video, let's go ahead and go over to Reddit. From here, you will be able to choose your desired content for your video. You can go over to the search bar and search for your desired content. I will go with something like confession because confessions always triggers curiosity. So after getting to your desired subreddit, you can also sort the content using this option. Let's go ahead and select top. After that, on this section, you can choose the date for the content. I will select this year to understand the popularity. And as you can see, we have the top contents for this year. This one has 70,000 upvotes, which means it's pretty popular. For now, let's go with the second one. After that, just go ahead and copy the whole content from this section. I will select the entire text and copy it. Then go over to NVIDIA and log in. I will select create short video from here. Then select create a fast paced video. Then on the video for section, I will select YouTube shorts. Now on the topic section, I will paste the copied text. After that on settings, you can use any of these options according to your preference. And for the background music, type in how you want the background music to be. As an example, I will type in happy and energetic. Now, you can also set the language for your video. So go through these options and select the one that you like. Then, if you want to add subtitles, you can also choose from these options available. This way, you can also add a voice actor for your video. You can choose the gender as well as the voice for the narration. Go through these options and select whichever one that you like. Then if you want, you can also add all of these options on the bottom. Once done, click on continue. So as you can see, the prompt has been generated by NVIDIA. Click on generate video. After that, you will get to this page over here. It says analyzing. And then once it's done, it will show thinking. So give it some time to get done. Sometimes it may take a little while. So on the next section, you can set the audience for your video. The options are based on your prompt. After that, set the look and feel from the options. You might have different options based on your prompt. After that, choose your desired platform. I will go with YouTube Shorts and click on Continue. And as you can see, our video is now being created by NVIDIA AI. It usually takes some time to get done. So you need to be patient and wait it out. And as you can see, our video is created. You can click on the edit option and check out different footages that has been used for this video. You can also select a specific footage and replace it from the stock media by going through these options and clicking on replace. This way, you can select any of these footages and replace them with your desired footage from the options. You can also generate media using AI. Just describe your scene and click on generate a clip. And once it's done, you can click on replace. If you want, you can also upload your own media. So click on upload and then click on replace. Then once done, click on apply. This way you get full control. So once done, click on save changes. And as you can see, our changes has been added. So after that, you can just go ahead and play your generated video in order to check it out. So click on the play button and check out your new Reddit story video. And as you watch the video, you will notice that each of the scenes are related to the story that is being set, which is a really good feature on NVIDIA. It gives meaning to the story being told. So this way, watch the entire video or check out different sections of the video to understand if NVIDIA used the proper clips for each of the parts. And if you want to make further changes, click on edit. After that, you can go over to the music section. Here you can check out the current music as well as replace it using stock music or upload your own music. 
if you select stock, you can go through these options and click on replace with the one that you like. After that, click on apply. And as you can see, the music has been replaced. And once you're done with making all the changes, just click on save changes on the bottom. And without saving the changes, you cannot check out other sections. So this is important. After that, just wait for the change to be applied. And once done, just go ahead and click on edit again. Over here, let's check out the script section. On the script part, you can check out the entire script that you used for this video. You can also make changes to your script according to your needs and preferences. You can try and make it even more interesting, but keep the meaning of the story. This way, go through each of the sections and make your desired changes. And if you click on the plus icon over here, you can add all of these options. On the right, you can also change your narrator settings. So go through it and if you make any changes, click on apply. If you click on stock media, you can also add different medias according to your preference. And if you do, just click on apply. So once you're done making all the changes, click on save changes. Then the same way, wait for it to get done. Now check out your entire video once again and you will notice all the changes has been applied. In video gives you a lot of control over the content that you generate using this platform. And if you want to make further changes, you can click on the plus icon on the top over here. Then make adjustments to your audiences, look and feel, and platform. So go through these options and make any necessary adjustments that you want to apply to your content. That way, in video will make your desired changes to your video once again. Now, Let's go ahead and download this video. For that, you need to click on this download option over here. After that, set your download settings. You can set the type of watermarks in Video AI Branding and Download Resolution. Then click on Download. After that, you'll be taken to this page over here. And as you can see, it is now preparing the video. On the top right, you will get to see your video being rendered. So wait for it to reach 100%. Then you can set the visibility settings for your video on NVIDIA AI platform. So set it according to your preference. And once it's 100%, your video will be downloaded onto your computer. Or you can also click on the download button on the bottom. Your video will start downloading right away. So by following these steps and using the tools provided by NVIDIA, you can create your own engaging and viral Reddit story videos. And that is exactly how to make Reddit story videos with AI.